Alrighty, what is going on, folks? A little, uh, little bit of show and tell for you in this one. I want to share with you three books that I make compulsory reading for anyone who is in my inner circle, for anyone who I work with one-to-one, and anyone that wants me to help them roll out an offer in a like revenue share, almost JV type capacity. I don't do a lot of that, but in the right circumstances, I do. Um, and 99% of the time, it's people who are already in my inner circle and or are one-to-one clients that wanna work directly on rolling out an offer, okay? I, uh, I have some books that I want them to read so that we're on a similar wavelength in terms of how we think about business, how we think about marketing, how we think about branding, how we think about positioning, uh, all of that kind of good stuff. All right, now, two of them I've got in hard copy. Um, one of them I've given to a, a friend to read and haven't got it back yet. So I'll talk to you about it, but I don't have the actual one here. All right, uh, before we jump into it, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel, give the video a like. If you get any value from it, or if you go and buy any of these books, read them and get value, come back and give the video a like. Uh, jump into my free private uh, community. There's a link in the description. I'll take you over to the Facebook group. We have a lot of fun over there. Get up to some shenanigans. And then further down in the description, there'll be some links to some of my paid programs. Uh, if you want to jump into any of those, um, yes, I sell stuff on this YouTube channel. If this is your first time here, um, that's how I operate. So I'll let you decide if that's something you're okay with or not. With that out of the way, these three books, all right? Now, you're gonna notice a very, very common theme between these three books, and they're all from the same author, okay? Uh, this is a dude who the, the internet marketing world has been so impacted by, um, and I think so many people don't even realize it, that it's, it's, it's crazy. Um, and, and I'm somebody who likes to go to the source when they're trying to learn something, so really, early 2020, I started consuming as much of his stuff as I could and um, have read nearly all of his books at this point, um, at least parts of them, um, kind of strategically picked out certain things depending on what I've got going on. Um, but I'll get, I'll make, he's got tons of books, I'll make my way through them all eventually, uh, been through a bunch of his courses and all that kind of stuff. All really evergreen, valuable information, all right? And who I'm talking about is Dan Kennedy. Okay, um, the guy that really got me into this game back in 2017, Russell Brunson, who runs ClickFunnels. Dan was one of his mentors. Um, and when I first read, got the book here. When I first read Dotcom Secrets, which is one of the first kind of online business books that I read, the foreword is by Dan Kennedy. But I didn't really appreciate it at the time who he was or how valuable his opinion was on these types of things or how much he had Im impacted this world that, that I kind of play in now um, and, and has really shifted the direction of my life because I moved from you know, corporate and, and, and I used to work in finance to, to running an online business these days. Okay, um, So they're all by him, right? The very, very first one, and this is the one that I'd probably recommend that you grab first because it is such a quick read. And I've, at this point, I've, I've read it, I've got the audible for it, I've read it or listened to it at least five, six, maybe seven times. Um, and it's called Renegade Millionaire, all right? Now, it's um, narrated on the audible by a dude named Adam Witte, who's uh, tied into a couple of Dan's other programs as well. But Renegade Millionaire, it's, you can, as you can see, it's a really short book. Um, it's really a quick fire, um, I guess, it's, it's a slap in the face about how you need to think in order to be successful, okay? And some of the things in here are gonna seem obvious and some of the things in here are going to go against conventional wisdom. Right, it is an awesome, awesome read that you can knock over very, 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 very quickly and will shift your perspective in a big way 
about business, about marketing, um, about how money is made, about what you need to do in order to make money, um, a lot of things. All right, so the kind of the, the hook of it is seven secrets to extreme wealth, autonomy, and entrepreneurial success. So I think anybody in business, online, offline, um, would be able to draw a lot um, from this. The, the biggest thing that I've taken from reading Dan's stuff, and it's repeated in this, um, and it's repeated in the next one that I'm gonna tell you about, is just not doing what everybody's doing, right? And there's a lot of people out there who talk about that stuff, um, but they don't really embody it. Um, in, the, in the internet marketing space, it's, it's constantly evolving, and if you find something that works, it doesn't take long for a lot of people to pile in, so you need to be innovating. You need to keep a pulse on what people are doing, and then you need to find your own way to do it and zig and zag and all that kind of stuff. And, and that's one of the core pillars of Dan's messaging. And it comes through in this in this Renegade Millionaire book. Um, so I have this, this is actually the second copy I bought. I gave one to my, my buddy Jamie who took it to Melbourne with him and um, then COVID happened and <laughs> the book got stuck down there. So I, that, that's how valuable this is to me. I, I have it on Audible and I reordered another copy because I like having it on my desk. Um, I pick it up from time to time and I, uh, and I read it, and I always get something different from it. It is so, it's so much valuable information packed into such a small book um, that it's, it's pretty unbelievable, all right? Um, so you've got seven, seven secrets, and uh, I think if you grab it, you'll absolutely, absolutely love it, all right? The next one that I send out to all my private clients. So these, these three I send out to them when they join the inner circle um, as, as, part of, um, as part of jumping in. They get, they get these copies shipped to them. Uh, and you know, some people might say, oh, but they're not, they're not your books. D Dan's gonna be able to say it better, say it better than I ever can um, with, his, with his huge wealth of experience. You can probably hear a fire alarm starting to go off in the background. They've been, uh, they've been testing it all day. The next one is this, no BS, wealth attraction in the new economy. And there's some overlapping concepts between Renegade Millionaire and this book, um, but where this probably talks a little bit more from a business perspective, this gets a little bit higher level, um, a little bit more big picture when it comes to how to think in order to you know, generate an abundance of money um, and be magnetic to money and be magnetic to wealth throughout your life, right? And, and it has, I think it's 20, uh, 20? Is it 20 or so wealth magnets that it talks about? Um, and each of them, sorry, 20, I think it's 23. 23 wealth, wealth magnets that all can play a massive, massive uh, part in what you're probably doing right now or what you want to do in the future. Um, they're either going to be relevant to you immediately or there will come a time where a light bulb will go off and you'll say, now I get that, right? Because with a lot of this stuff where you're learning and, and you know, it crosses into personal development and business, you've got to be ready for that information. You've got to have a use for that information. So I've read stuff that at the time I've gone, that doesn't apply to me or I have no idea what he's talking about. And then in six months time, I've gone, fuck, that's what he was talking about, right? Like one of the big ones for me was um, Dan Kennedy's content talks a lot about boundaries and setting boundaries, right? Everyone's out there talking about how do you get clients? There's very few people talking about how do you manage clients? And that's one of the thing that Dan talks a lot about. And, and I remember reading earlier days consuming his stuff where he talks about you've got to set boundaries with clients and um, that's some stuff we've done in the corporate world but, but for whatever reason in my uh, early days ignorance I, I didn't fully appreciate the importance of it online as well um, when you can be really really accessible to people and it wasn't until we rolled out the super affiliate accelerator program started taking on hundreds of customers uh, that my Facebook inbox very very quickly started to resemble like an absolute fucking mess and when that problem reared its head, then the piece of advice became relevant, right? So some of the stuff you consume in these might not be relevant to you right now, but if you keep going with this online business game and, and pursuit of, of money, um, these will all pop up at, 
at some point. And so you've got a combination of strategy, a combination of things you should do, a combination of, of, of ways that you should and shouldn't think. Um, but these two, in terms of uh, approach to business, approach to life, in order to, you know, ideally attract a lot of money into your, into your world and into your business, are going to be unbelievably, unbelievably powerful. So they're the first two that I send out. And then the third one, which I don't have a hard copy of with me right now, is from this same series, this No BS series, um, and it's called No BS Time Management. All right, now, like I said before, one of the, one of the strong foundational kind of concepts that Dan talks a lot about is boundaries. And with that is time protection, protecting that one asset that you can never get back. And that's what the time management book is all about. And one of my favorite concepts from it that he goes into in a lot more detail is about managing the supply and demand of your time and how that can directly correlate to increasing your prices, right? So getting your calendar under control and positioning yourself in a way that people won't waste your time and not allowing people to waste your time and how that directly correlates to making more money, right? I think people separate those two things, like the, the tactics and the strategies around making money and then managing time. Um, but it goes just beyond, you know, if I've got more time to work in my business or on my business that I'm gonna make money, actually how you utilize your time and then how that in turn changes your positioning can allow you to charge more, which will facilitate you making a lot more money, increasing your margins, all that kind of stuff. So that's the third one. I don't have that copy on me. I gave it to a friend and I um, need to get it back. But they're the three that I send out to my private clients, my inner circle members, my one-to-one -one clients, anyone that wants me to kind of come on board on a revenue share basis, just because they've had such a big impact on me, they've had such a big impact on the way that I think, on the things that I do in my business, on the things that I do in my brand, that people that I lock arms with and wanna help them achieve what I've been able to achieve, they need to read it, right? It just, it shortcuts everything and it makes everything easier if we're on the same page about that stuff. If we're thinking in similar ways because of consuming that, that's why I get them in their hands. Literally, the day some, we had, I had someone jump into my inner circle this morning, sent a message to my assistant, I said, here's their details, can you please order um, these three books that I just showed you so that they get in their hands, you know, ideally within the week, they can read them and then our time together is going to be even more valuable because they're going to have this prerequisite information. All right, so I wanted to share that with you. Go and grab a copy of them um, or if you want me to pay for it for you, you can uh, get in touch with us potentially about the, the inner circle. It's really only an invitation only program. Um, typically I see people who've come through my other programs and done really cool stuff and, and invite them. Um, but you know, if you wanna raise your hand and, and put your case forward, uh, we'd be happy to, to hear it as well. But they're the three books. I'd recommend that you read them at some point now or, or in the near future because they will really, really help you in, in any endeavor that you're currently undertaking or wanna undertake in the future. All right, be sure to give this video a like if you get any value from it, if you grab the books, if you've got any views on these books, if you have read them, I'd be interested to hear what you have to say about them because they've had a massive impact on me. Uh, check out the links in the description, join the private Facebook community, check out the, the, the products and the programs and all that kind of stuff. And uh, I will talk to you all in the next video. Cheers.